Jean-Claude Parent had teamed up with the philosopher um, Paul Virilio in the 1960s. Paul Virilio, in turn, had um, an interest in the, uh, the bunkers that the Germans created um, on the coasts of uh, France. Um, these bunkers, after the war, had uh, halfway sunken into the, um, into the sand. Paul Virilio visited them and photographed there and uh, experienced a kind of vertigo because these spaces were not uh, even anymore, but all uh, shifted and, and tilted. Paul Virilio and Claude Perron then teamed up in the 1960s to create the um, group uh, Architecture Principe and uh, advocated the idea of the oblique, um, claiming that the, the time of uh, vertical and horizontal surfaces that have re had really um, coined the, the, the time of modernism and functionalism and this idea of the white uh, um, box, that this time was over and that we needed um, uh, diagonal, oblique uh, surface surfaces, as well as in, in, in interiors, as well as in also um, urban landscaping. And uh, Claude Parent um, propagated this idea in a pavilion in the 19, in 1970s, um, but then also in his own home, where he really put these oblique surfaces um, in, into his home. Um, and uh, on a metaphorical level, the idea was that um, it also represented the shifting uh, social hierarchies um, at that time, because on a uh, diagonal surface, you cannot just stand um, safe and flat, but you always have to sort of regain your posture um, as you move um, in, on this tilted um, surface, which also speaks about sort of general social um, upheavals at the time.